TV5, this is Eyewitness News with Paul Shields and Jackie Maddox. Mark Bradley with weather and the Eyewitness News team. Full amount is paid. Designer apparel, <laughs> fastly becoming an American way of life, Paul. Sure is, and in a moment we're going to show you some of the designers and the fashions things, and uh, I'm going to read it right the next time. We've got a designer next. He's called King of the After Five Ensemble. You can catch his fashions in the nation's leading fashion stores and stores like Neiman Marcus. His line has sold in the millions. Who is this designer next to me? None other than the ever-famous Victor Costa. We welcome him to our studios today. Thank, Thank you for you. coming. Thank you. It's great to be here. I'm Terrific. sure. Listen, are your dresses, we're here, we hear Neiman Marcus, we hear Saks, we hear all the famous stores, specialty shops that you're in. Can I afford to buy? Well, that's, that's my whole gift that clothes look like they're ten times as much but they do not break the bank. What are we talking here? Well, we start at under 200 and we go to three and to four, nothing much over that. I'm looking at a gorgeous dress, one of in your line, famous mm -hmm. uh, in some respects already. Oh yeah, Brooke Shields bought this and, and this month in the September issue of Can You Believe It, uh, National Geographic, they have a double page spread on this. They did a story on, on Dallas, the city, and they have a big stretch limousine with this $300 dress. It's my crumb catcher and Brooke Shields bought it. And that's a history of costume term because in the olden days they wore something up here that caught the crumbs. But uh, I think it's more about of a, the, the, yeah, the, the ruffle. Uh, I ruffle. think it's more of a diamond catcher. And that skirt is divine. She twirls, you'll see it's just like a parachute. The air gets up under it. What is that? Gold lame? Gold lame. Liquid gold, honey. Liquid gold. <laughs> I love it. We're, we're in a, uh, a, a rut of he, she fashion androgyny with everybody wanting, you know, mannish clothes on women. And I'm against it, so I'm out for femininity and to show and the body beautiful. God Paul. bless you. And, yeah, I hear Paul over here saying God. He snuck in Dallas, Paul. Uh, this is a, a guy who made it outside of New York. Well, and I lived in New York for 20 years and kind of developed myself and my talent, and then moved back home to Texas. Here's one of the kinds that I'm known for: under $200, great for a party. The focus on uh, the body, accentuating the bosom, everything that a man wants to see in a woman. These are clothes for when the occasion demands she looks her prettiest. Who is that model? Who is that model? Who is that this red, red hot holiday yeah, model? the woman in red. <laughs> uh, very lovely. D? Holly. Holly. Okay, very good, Holly. That's a gorgeous dress. You started in a garage. Well, right? yes, as a teenager, I got my first sewing machine at age 12 and uh, started sewing for people and learning my craft. What did neighborhood boys think about you sewing at the age of 12? Well, if they didn't like it and they said something off color, I'd hit him on the head with my purse. Well, you're big enough. I wouldn't tangle with you either, you rascal. <laughs> Victor Costa, you're, you're a million-dollar man, a million-dollar designer. Very quickly, uh, if we can get this one other dress in, your fashions are so lovely. They can be found at Neiman Marcus here. Uh, Joni uh, Meredith has a... Uh, yes, I just got back from the Orient, and this is a fabric I bought in Japan. Okay. It's specially woven, all the metallic, precious jewels. Okay, I, I, my chiffon. producer said to say thank you. I mean, it's just killing us to have to. But wow. thank you, Joni Meredith. Thank you, Holly. Thank you, Victor Costa. You're welcome. You're going to be at Neiman's, right? At Neiman Marcus. Okay. Thank you, Victor. Don't forget your purse. <laughs> now here's an editorial from Vice President.